evening, everyone. Good evening. Um, I think town halls are a great opportunity for us to find out what constituents are thinking about, what people in the city are thinking about. Um, I represent uh, Northeast Baltimore, um, so the 43rd Legislative District. Our district spans from this North Avenue at Hartford Road all the way up to the county line, over to Charles Street, down grabs uh, part of Hopkins, Tuscany, Canterbury, a little bit of Camden, uh, Remington, comes all the way back down um, Falls Road, actually, all the way near the river, and then back down uh, North Avenue. So just like our city and our state and our country, it offers all of our opportunities and what's great about our state of Maryland and the city of Baltimore, and it also uh, conveys some of our greatest challenges. And one of the things that I think and I believe in is that Baltimore City is a wonderful place to live that, and that it has the opportunity to continue to be the economic engine for the entire state. And I see my role as a delegate in Annapolis as a member of the Appropriations Committee is to continue to make sure that the rest of the state of Maryland knows how much our success is invested in their success or is linked to their success. Um, and I've done that over the last three years, um, advocating for, I'm sure you've heard other people talk about school construction, um, um, talk about ways that we can continue to invest in our schools, but also into our communities. Um, we need better transportation systems. I'm very interested in seeing how MTA can make sure that the people who are, are working and able to work can get to their jobs, making sure that the, um, the businesses that we have along York Road, Greenmount Avenue, North Avenue, the Alameda, um, Harford Road, that people from all over the city of Baltimore can get there easily. So I'm interested in those things. Um, I'm interested in making sure that our young people who are interested in going to college can afford to do that, um, making sure that the schools prepare them to do that, and making sure for those of them who are able to and have the talent to work with their hands and to build things have an opportunity to do that. And that might mean that they do that here in Maryland, but it also might mean that we provide opportunities for them to connect with people in other states and possibly other countries. Um,